Hi everyone. Most of us use PowerPoint to create presentations. But how many of us know we can create ebooks with PowerPoint in a simple and easy way? You can create a really attractive ebook with PowerPoint. Now it is the world with a digital trend. Many people want to create their own ebooks. But many don't know how to create or assume it's costlier to create an ebook. Let us really see quickly how we can create ebooks with PowerPoint. Go to the design menu and select slide size. From the drop down select custom slide size. In the slide size window, from the drop down of option slide size for select letter paper. Set orientation to portrait and click on OK. Since we changed the slide size, select the suitable slide scale in the next window. Select Maximize. Now the slide is set to the size of letter paper and printer. You can delete the text box. To the delete, select the text box and hit delete. Now you have the empty slide. Now you can design the book as you like it. We are trying to create a simple ebook as per our needs. Go to insert, select shapes and take rectangle from it. Now draw a rectangle as the title bar. You can change the filling color by selecting the color from shape fill under shape format section. Now let's add the sidebar similarly we did. Now to bring the title bar above the sidebar, select the title bar and right click. In the context menu, select bring to front option. Now let's add the title. To do that, click on insert and select text box. Now draw the text box on title bar and give a title. You can change font type, size and color as per your need. Once you give the title, under the shape or format section you will see font type, font size, and font color options. Once the title is given, now add the text to the page. Book will most importantly have the text and you can insert one more text box and write whatever text you need in the ebook. To do that go to insert and select text box. Now insert the text box wherever you want on the page and insert text into it. You can again resize and change the font style for the content text box. You can select the text box and move around by dragging the mouse. This way you can text wherever you are linked on that page. If you want to insert pictures into the book page, go to insert. Then select picture from the drop down and select this device. You can choose to select stock images or online pictures as per your need. Select the picture you want to insert and click on insert. You can crop the image if you need to by going to the shape format section and selecting the crop option. You can also select and drag the image or text boxes using the mouse to move them to the position where you want to place them. If you want to replicate the same style in a new slide, select the slide in the slides bar, right click, and select the duplicate slide option. Now you can modify the new slide as per your requirement. And you can repeat the process until you complete your book. Once you have completed your book, click on file and select save.
Select this PC and select the location where you want to save PowerPoint presentation by giving the required name to it. Now save it as a PDF. Give your book a name. Now change the file type to PDF and click on save. Now you have your PDF book ready with you.